Hey everybody, Adjective Gaming here. So I wrote a simple Python script that scans a list of 45,000 video games, and it chooses a game for me to play at random. This is Roulette's Play. Okay, so as you can see, I kept my promise. I both came back, and also I brought a new wallpaper with me. Hope you all like Cyberpunk. I mean, all the greats are here. You have Boot up here, Iron Man over here, Got this guy down here. Anyway, let, let's just see what we get today. Enthusia Professional Racing 2005 Konami PlayStation 2. I'm hoping that Enthusia is some sort of unknown African country, and this game has you racing through like the Sahara on elephants and giraffes. That's probably what it is. When driving cars in real life, please follow the traffic rules and drive safely. Okay, Mom. If you believe you can, if you believe you can, therefore you can. Uh, very wise. Thank you. Thank you for that. Uh, this, uh, this is a racing game, correct? Guys? This is a racing game, right? Guys? This is weird. You know, normally you just put, like, cars racing in their tracks, but this is, like, obscure art. Oh, okay, there we go. I, I see some cars. I was getting a little worried. Is anybody else offended by the production value of this intro? I mean, this is the most unnecessary thing I've seen before a game starts. This better not be like a, a car RPG or something. Oh look, dreams do come true. She finally found true love with that car. That's, uh, I'm very confused. Cool. Oh wait, there's more? Okay. Sometimes it happens. Great. Okay, let's just play the damn game. Okay, so you have Enthusia Life, Driving Revolution, Time Attack, Free Racing, and Versus Mode. Battle Mode, curiously missing. Ah, oh, nice. It hits you with that, that nice non-specific racing game music. <laughs> Brilliant. Enthusia Life seems to be the career mode. You have a wide range of beginner vehicles to choose from. You have the Nissan March. You got the fun cargo van. You got the new Beetle. Another van. A blue van. The Mitsubishi Cappuccino. Did not expect this much reading from a racing game. Just let me drive my damn car. Oh my god. All this talking. All these tutorials. Alright, so now how do I... Go. Nope. Reverse. I'm being sabotaged. Get this off my screen. Alright. Very basic driving game. Does that sign say anal? No. No. Not my info points. I need those. Alright, I'm gonna... this car. Mario Kart bitch. No, get back here. No. I'm not gonna pay... I'm not, I'm not gonna place last. I can't place last. I can still do this. Come on. Hey, I did it. I, I proved the odds right. Ah uh, yes, a map of the collisions I had with the fence. Very, uh, logistical. I lost all my Enthu points. And the only way to get them back is to complete five races. Yeah, that's, that's not happening. Just get me out of here. Get, get me out of this mode. Oh my god. Stop talking. Get me out of here. Alright, let's, let's see what the... The driving revolution's about. Welcome to Driving Revolution. The player must hit indicators. Yeah, no, no, thank you. All right, free race. Here we go. It's just a NASCAR ring. Nothing, nothing can go wrong. Yeah, sure. All right. All right, I can handle this thing. No problem. Okay, the early 2000 Sonic music is blaring in the background. 
All right, three. Here we go. Two, one. And the game crashed. To be honest, I probably would have just crashed three seconds in and just turned the game off anyway. Enthusia Professional Racing. Bizarre intro. Generic gameplay. Not sure what they had to offer over what uh, Gran Turismo or Project Gotham Racing could give them. So I'm gonna give it a uh, two gods out of five. Also, it's gonna it's gonna receive the uh, Honk Honk Award because it had such amazing car sounds. 